dialectical materialism, a philosophical approach to reality derived from the teachings of Karl Marx and Friedrich Engels. For Marx and Engels, materialism meant that the material world, perceptible to the senses, has objective reality independent of mind or spirit. They did not deny the reality of mental or spiritual processes, but affirmed that ideas could arise, therefore, only as products and reflections of material conditions. Marx and Engels understood materialism as the opposite of idealism, by which they meant any theory that treats matter as dependent on mind or spirit, or mind or, or spirit as capable of existing independently of matter. For them, the materialist and idealist views are irreconcilably opposed throughout the historical development of philosophy. They adopted a thoroughgoing materialist approach, holding that any attempt to combine or reconcile materialism with idealism must result in confusion and inconsistency. Marx's and Engels' conception of dialectics owes much to G.D.F. Hegel. In opposition to the metaphysical mode of thought, uh, which viewed things in abstraction, each by itself and as though endowed with fixed properties, Hegelian dialectics considers things in their movements and changes, interrelations and interactions. Everything is in continual process of becoming and ceasing to be, in which nothing is permanent but everything changes and eventually superseded. All things contain contradictory sides or aspects, whose tension or conflict is the driving force of change and eventually transforms or dissolves them. But whereas Hegel saw society and development as the expression of the, whole, of the world spirit or idea, realizing itself in nature and in human society, for Marx and Engels, change was inherent in the nature of the material world. They therefore held that one could not, as Hegel tried, deduce the actual course of events from any principles of dialectics. The principles must be inferred from the events. The theory of knowledge of Marx and Engels started from the materialist premise that all knowledge is derived from the senses, but against the mechanist view that derives knowledge exclusively from given sense impressions, they stressed the dialectical development of human knowledge socially acquired in the course of practical activity. Individuals can gain knowledge of things only through their practical interaction with those things, framing their ideas corresponding to their practice, and social practice alone provides the test for the correspondence of idea with reality, i.e. of truth. This theory of knowledge is opposed equally to the subjective idealism, according to which individuals can only know sensible appearances while things in themselves are elusive, and to the objective idealism, according to which individuals can know supersensible reality by pure intuition or thought, independent of sense. The concept of dialectical materialism which is, the, which is a theoretical basis for a method of reasoning, should not be confused with historic materialism, which is the Marxist interpretation of history in terms of the class struggle. There exists no systematic exposition of dialectical materialism by Marx and Engels, who stated their philosophical views mainly in the course of polemics.